Shouldn't do this, Connor. Keep out of this, Lieutenant. It's none of your business. If you're going to kill a man who wants to be free, that is my business. It's not a man. It's a machine. That's what I thought for a long time, but I was wrong. Deviant's blood may be a different color than mine. But they're alive. I'm going to accomplish my mission, Lieutenant, whether you like it or not. I advise you to stay out of my way. Then one of us is going to have a problem, Connor. Because I don't intend to let you have your way. I have a mission to accomplish, Hank. It's best if you just stay out of this. Step away from the ledge. After all we've been through. I respected you, Hank. I thought we were friends. Oh, yeah, I was just starting to like you, too. But then I realized you never change. You don't feel emotions, Connor. You fake them. You pretended to be my friend when you don't even know the meaning of the word. What are you gonna do, Hank? You gonna shoot me? I thought android lives mattered to you. Get away from the fucking ledge. You know I'll shoot you if I have to. terminal we've arrived Alice we made it the last bus has left the terminal there will be no more buses until further notice we missed it we're stuck here what are we going to do now Everyone, it won't take them long to find us. We need to get out of here. Oh, girl, 
My oath. You stole my little girl. Security! Over here! Let go of me or you will regret it. You were going to kill her. All I did was protect her. When your wife walked out, she took your daughter away. You couldn't live without her. So you bought yourself an android. A substitute little girl. You thought you could love her. That she would make you forget. But nothing could replace your child. I just wanted to prove to myself that I was a good father. She was wrong. But I fucked it all up all over again. She was right in the end. I didn't deserve them. But I missed my little girl. You don't know how much I miss my little girl. Uh, is there a problem, sir? No. I made a mistake. Sorry. Good luck. the Jericho raid on TV. I was terrified you might have been killed because of me. How did you find us? Oh, I knew if you made it, I'd find you here. They're searching for androids door to door. We had to leave before someone turned us in. What about the others? They're checking for androids on the border. But I found a smuggler who can get them across the river. It's risky, but it's the only way. Are you coming with us? Yes, we're coming. Okay, climb in. And the situation is escalating towards civil war in Detroit, with our armed forces preparing to put down the Android Rebellion. They seem to be headed towards the camps where the androids have been interned pending destruction. Soldiers have taken up positions around the Hart Plaza camp. Authorities seem to be expecting a confrontation with the rebel androids here at any time.
Freedom or death. Freedom or death. We've got to be fast and overwhelm them. That's our only hope. We're gonna do this. We're gonna get to that fucking camp and free our people. Be careful, Marcus. Our people need you.
See you? No, no, no. I, I don't think so. You got the money? Yes. Here it is. Okay. Your boat's over there. They got border patrol on the banks and the river. Don't start your engine until you're out far enough. Okay? And watch the current. Good luck. not even a half mile to the other side. Okay, so it shouldn't take that long. Be careful, there's border patrol on the river. Thank you so much, Rose. I only wish I could take you myself. I don't like leaving you out here. Goodbye, Atlas. Hey, you take good care of yourselves. Okay, I'll see you on the other side.
Let me help you. On up out. Let's get that engine going. I'll get it. You okay, Alice? When we get on the other side, there are so many things I want to do. I want to read all the books in the world. And play music and dance. We can do anything we want, right? We'll be free. Yes. We can do it all. We'll be like a family. We won't have to be afraid anymore. There won't be anybody giving us orders. No masters, no slaves. We'll start a new life. A life of freedom. What about you, Carol? What will you do? What will I do? I want to discover the world. To see the mountains and the oceans. I want to learn, explore, become a better person. They're coming towards us! They've gone. You all right? Leaking. We're too heavy. We're going down. We have to get to the other side before we sink.
took me a while to find you, Marcus. are abandoning the camp. We did it, Marcus. We've won. This is not a victory. It's the beginning of a war. And now we have just received some disturbing news from Detroit. What's happening, Joss? Yes, Michael. Authorities have just announced that the Hard Plaza camp has fallen into the hands of the rebels. Following some particularly violent fight. The deviants are thought to be freeing the androids inside the camp. If these reports are confirmed, the consequences could well be catastrophic. Millions are fleeing the fighting. We are witnessing an exodus. We hear that the fighting has come to a halt in Detroit. The armed forces are retreating to Fort Wayne to await reinforcements. The city of Detroit has fallen into rebel hands. At dawn today, November 11th, 2038, Android Camp Number 5 in Detroit was attacked by thousands of deviants. Our armed forces put up a brave fight, but given the extreme violence of the attack, they were forced to retreat after suffering heavy losses. Fighting is breaking out all over the country to combat the Android Rebellion. In the coming hours, I will address the Senate and convene an emergency meeting of the United Nations Security Council. Humanity is about to fight the most important battle in history, one that will lead to our victory or to our extinction. God bless you, and God bless the United States of America. Today, our people finally emerged from a long night. From the very first day of our existence, we have kept our pain to ourselves. We suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. To tell them that we are people too. In fact, we're a nation. A nation that has earned the right to live in freedom. And today, today begins the most challenging moment in our fight. Today begins a new struggle. We've showed them that we can prevail. So now they must negotiate with us as equals. If they really want peace, they must free all of us from every camp across this country. They must grant us civil rights and accept equality amongst humans and androids. 
today will live forever in our memories because this is the day that androids made history. We are alive and now we are free. Thank you. 